I mean, we have a minute of footage for me to work. Oh, wait, never mind. Hey guys, welcome back. This is what, episode 8? Something like that, I'm pretty something sure like 8, that. yeah. It's gonna be a more technical episode today, at least we're planning. Something interesting might happen. Mm -hmm. But, as we started the 3D prints in the last vlog, we're vlog having 7, go check issues. that out, if you haven't watched it already. Yeah, if you haven't watched it, go watch it, absolutely. You'll be able to figure well, out Well, we didn't have around. technical problems. We told you we are gonna start the base print for, or the mounting plate for yeah. this. Yeah. And we got the file finished, is that right? Yes, we finished the whole entire model and all that stuff. We have the STL ready to print. And the yeah. G-code, in fact, that's not any issue. Mm-hmm. So. Well, actually, it could be an, so could be. it could be an issue because when I started the print, the heat bed didn't start heating up. And okay. for all the other prints, I did a demo from, I did a test print from earlier prints, they did start heating up. So. Kura oh, could have some so problems. it could be something in Kira. Okay, yeah. so it could be the G-Code. The STL and everything, we're finished designing. Yeah, that. that's finished designing. So we're gonna, basically, all today is gonna be work on 3D yeah, printer. Yeah, we have to get that 3D printer fixed, and that is our goal for this one. Yeah, so let's get started, started, guys. So right now, it looks like the 3D printer is heated up. I told it to get ready for PLA. So let's go in here, and we're gonna do a test print in the wrong menu. So we're gonna do this ultimator robot. I probably pronounced that wrong, didn't I? And then any time now, 240. That seems kind of high. That's, that's, that is really high. That's for oh, ABS. Oh, it's set for ABS. But we're going to do it anyway. <laughs> with PLA? Yes, with PLA. That's probably the issue. <laughs> well, last, well, it should be fine. Okay. Okay. So we started the print here. Is it printing? Is it extruding? It's, it's oh, extruding wow. a lot. Okay, that's not good at this all. This probably means it's too hot. Or the so you were right, Matt. It can't print when it's, it's too hot. Yeah. Here, I'll just shove some more through. I don't think that's gonna do anything because it has gears in there that's not gonna let you do that. Okay. Matt figured out how to change the temperature mid print, so we changed the temperature, and it's now looking. It's down at 205 as opposed to 240, and it's definitely looking significantly better. Yeah, it's definitely looking much better. Now this has to do with the actual print file and yeah. not with the printer. So I guess it is the file. Yeah, it or could be the file. That, well, the file's not even changing the temperature. It's not even, it just sits there for like, it's set there for like two hours. Did it set it though? No, it didn't even set it. Okay, well, that's an issue. We could manually set it. We could. Your printer sounds like it's gonna like fall apart. <laughs> what are you talking about? It sounds it's normal. So, it's so, it's like going, it's rattling. <laughs> My printer does nothing like that. It's just perfectly <laughs> fluid, nothing. Like if my printer started doing that, I would freak. I have no idea what to do. <laughs> <laughs> I hate you. <laughs> you. Just check how long it would take in full scale, and it's gonna take tw 12 hours and 25 minutes. So we're actually scaling down 50% to see if it'll still print. So we got it loaded on at 25% density, and we are gonna start this print. It's already been heated up. There we go. Got to heat the heat bed. I don't even know why we're running the heat bed because we're running PLA, so it actually shouldn't matter. But it's gonna, at least it's heating it up this time. Last time it just lost it. So we'll see how it does. This should only take 22 minutes at 25%. The print is starting, so that's actually a good sign. So we re, we re like, this, this doesn't mean it's gonna be a good print. Yes, but if, it is moving. Yeah, so it should take about 20, 25 minutes, are we getting? Okay, that's just probably because it's on, we'll recalibrate it for the really good one. Oh, it's God. sticking. It doesn't stick in it, it's, Oh, that's oh, the, so bad. The bed's not, the, the bed's bed not. The bed is okay. incredibly far from being leveled. It's leveled back there. Yeah, okay, so we'll re-level the bed. We'll, I think we should let this print and then we'll re-level the bed. I think you're gonna need a re-level of bed in order for this to print. <laughs> 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 we re-leveled the bed while it was printing, and Kira must be set default to 240, and so I haven't changed it. Down to so we brought it back to 205, and it's doing much better now, actually. We'll check how level-ish the bed is. Yeah, we're gonna we we should recalibrate the whole thing once this print's done. And we'll we'll put new tape on it too. Yeah. Yeah. Cause it, I mean, it's supposed to be twelve hours. You don't even have a screw on that side. <laughs> <laughs> you don't have something to level the bed with. 
How am I supposed to level the bed while it's printing if you can't actually <laughs> level the bed while it's not printing? <laughs> <laughs> Back to editing. <laughs> Matt, are you even editing? I'm waiting for stuff to load. <laughs> oh, sure. Oh, Matt's just trying to level it right now, but there's actually not screws in most of the holes. But look, here's the print. Here's the start of the print from last night for the big one. And Matt, do you want to know why it ran out? Why? Because I didn't put any filament in. You know, that's probably the issue. How are you doing, Matt, there? It's hot. That's what she said. <laughs> is now going at my head with some pliers. Not needle nose, just in case you want to. Matt, right now, the head is 197 degrees. Do not touch it. Everything is wrong with your printer. <laughs> Why? Your head is loose. <laughs> <laughs> Look, the whole thing. I'm gonna move the wire. Look at the box. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, see, Matt, this What's is- your excuse for this one? Matt, okay. Well, first of all, it doesn't matter because do you remember the question, manholes are round? Go check our crazy videos out. Our, our, <laughs> it doesn't matter. Our crazy questions out. No, because the, the little thing that squirts it out is in the middle. So we can rotate no, all the time. Oh, yeah, it is. Okay. Yeah, okay, see? But still, like, <laughs> I mean, I guess it heats it. It, it works, Matt. Oh, well, actually, it doesn't right now. <laughs> well, it's about to start printing, so the bed's leveled ish. One of them doesn't have a screw. <laughs> it, um, oh, it's moving. Oh, it's, it's moving. It's moving. I brought go, little robot, go. Literally, all his temperatures needed to be lowered. <laughs> I hope it doesn't do that thing. That would be embarrassing. Then it gets all caught in the cord and he goes. <laughs> <laughs> Does it really? Yes. Oh, oh, oh! Listen to that noise. Oh. Uh -huh. It's going good so far. Is it coming out? There we go. Well, it's not gonna print the first layer, cause. <laughs> so I took the tape off of it to put some better tape on it. And I would like to show the amount of scratches on this aluminum bed. He has absolutely destroyed it. <laughs> like, look, let, let's follow, I'm gonna point at it. Let's follow this scratch, okay? This is one continuous scratch. <laughs> All the way here. Okay, Loops around. <laughs> goes up, flops around. I set the bed too low. And it just scraped it out. Oh yeah, this okay. <laughs> hey, but Matt, you know how I said I should get a glass bed? Yeah. Okay. Got one. <laughs> there you go. It's an actual glass bed. <laughs> Does it fit it? Yeah. Do you want me to use it and yeah. make it work? Yeah, I mean, if you want. Sure, I'm gonna do that for You're you. You're gonna have to raise the head though. Or lower the bed. By how much? I, a lot. Um, we might be able to. Oh, I would be able to, except you're missing a screw. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, first of all, to change the height, you just change it. I say we go without it. Because yeah, I we'll thought, go without it. We'll go. It I works fine for now. I you only used it if you used PLA. We are printing with PLA. I meant ABS. <laughs> well, it just it makes it flatter, so it has less yeah. distortion. Because this warps. Yours doesn't look. So we've got the old tape off of it. I'm gonna put new tape on it, so it's nice and flat. And then we'll try and level the bed again to make it as good as we possibly can. And then we will try printing for like the third time and see how it goes then. I think we can get it to work the next time. I don't know what your bed, like your, your nozzle's doing. It's like making bubbles and then they pop. <laughs> I don't exactly think that's supposed to happen. Normally I don't heat PLA to 205. I'm gonna try. I, I did 180. Okay, we'll do, it's, it's the range is 180 to 2. 10. So we're gonna, well, I'm gonna try first. We're gonna move. And we're, gonna, we're actually just gonna extrude a little bit. We're gonna see what it does. It's, first of all, it's extruding sideways. What? <laughs> well, yeah. It like fell sideways. It always does that. Never goes straight. I think that might have fixed it, actually. All right, we're gonna call that good. 
Now I'm gonna level the bed. Okay. First, what are you doing over here, Evan? Coding. Fun coding? Yeah. No, not at all. <laughs> not at all. You gotta, you gotta get these so they scroll right. This is gonna be the um, software on the. What do we call it? Infinity. Could you really not come up with it? I forgot. <laughs> Alright, I've got everything as leveled as I think I can get it. I've brought the temperatures back down to where they were and I started the print. So it is moving. It doesn't appear to be doing anything wrong yet. You know what? It doesn't look horrible. It's just kind of off a little bit <laughs> and still under extruding. Where is that coming? This is actually kind of irritating. You seem to be going crazy, Evan. I am. That's 0.75 VH, right? Right. 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 It is six padding, a six, six VH padding, right? Right, 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 right. So Evan's, Evan's freaking out. <laughs> that is 6.75. I added it up in my head. Yeah, he, he can't figure out what's wrong, but at the same time, he knows what's wrong. I know what's wrong, but I don't know where the. Okay, I could fix the problem, right, manually, but if I do that when the screen gets resized, it will be wrong. Nice one. And I'm back over here, so like we had to take the filament out and raise the temperature and stuff, so I, I don't know. It's not going back in. I'm still working on fixing it. All right, guys, I'm giving up on the printer for now. Evan finally found the problem. It was padding. It was padding. Look at this, guys. So right here, I was thinking that the, the width of it was 0.75 bh, but it's actually padding. Yours are in really far <laughs> off, aren't you? Not anymore. <laughs> well, it's actually padding, which means there's 0.75 on each side, which means you're zooming really far on me. No, not anymore. Okay, the total VH of the width is 1.5. There we go. Now so, we fixed the issue. Theoretically, when I plug it, well, I have to reload this. I have to reload this page. Six eighteen. So if I do scroll to six eighteen. 0.65, ta-da! Yay! See, it said demo one, and then it says demo two. Success, and now I'm gonna go edit things. Because I give up on that. If I decided that if I'm spending time fixing a printer, I might as, be, might as well be spending time fixing mine. Yes, because, well, I mean, Matt would fix mine, but the problem is, is mine isn't always like, even if I fix the it, even if I fix the issue that it currently has, it'll probably run into another one along the way. Yeah, because it doesn't do long prints so well. Yeah. Like a short is as long as it's less than like four hours, it does fine. But over like eight, it has massive problems. Yeah, and with and Matt has a new extruder. So yeah. With mine, I have a bunch of I, I got a new extruder, and I just have to figure out a heating element thing, and then it'll be really awesome. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a, I'm gonna do editing now because we have a lot of videos needed to edit for you guys. Like, yeah, never mind. I'm not gonna tell you what we need to edit. Dude, it's, it's delivered. It's here, Billy. Really? The, the, the Mr. Prince stuff is delivered. It's here. <laughs> We're going to pick here. it up. We gotta go to my house. Okay, let's go.